am Alexis and I've chosen to be celibate for seven years now. I have received a lot of backlash, mainly from males. I cannot see one single reason why this would be of interest to anybody. Another attention seeker. She has no idea what she's missing out on. She better not let me catch her in public. I'm Alexis's uh, father. In the back of my mind, I just knew you were gonna be like me. Seeking out partners. Just felt like you'd be missing out on a big part of life. By being celibate, are you afraid that uh keep guys away from you? I am Alexis. I was fed up with dating, so I decided to become celibate. I have currently been celibate for about seven years now. I decided to become celibate due to spiritual development, tired of the dating apps, and just decided to focus solely on my spiritual growth. I started making TikTok content about three months ago about my celibacy journey. Since I publicly came out based on my decision to become celibate, I have received a lot of backlash, mainly from males. A lot of hate comments. The worst thing I have received is assault threat online. And this is from males twice my seniors. It's disgusting. Some of the comments I have received since sharing my celibacy story are, who asked? Also, who would want to be with a person who's willing to do that? The sheer stubbornness and determination it would take to be in a relationship with the person would be a nightmare. I cannot see one single reason why this would be of interest to anybody. Another attention seeker. She has no idea what she's missing out on. She better not let me catch her in public. Sometimes it does take me back a bit, but other times I find myself calling my friends or family just to bring me back to reality, to remind me that those people don't know me. In the beginning, since becoming celibate, it was a bit challenging due to my decision, which was pretty much different than my peers around me at the time. However, because I have a solid support system, they tend to help make the process a bit easier. At this current time, I do not miss intimacy. However, that is due to my diagnosis with endometriosis. A lot of the symptoms that comes from endometriosis impacts my day-to-day -day life. It has impacted my dating life in the past where it hurts, intimacy hurts physically. With celibacy, it is easier for me to solely focus on myself rather than become intimate with someone and introduce them to something that they're not necessarily comfortable with. I actually plan on being celibate until I find the right person. However, if I don't find the right person, the rest of my life. Today, my dad is coming over to discuss my decision on becoming celibate. However, I am very nervous about this. When I revealed to my dad that I decided to become celibate, he was floored. He was stunned. The young lady I was in my 20s is the complete opposite of who I am now in my 30s. I'm Alexis's uh, father. What did you think when she first told you that she was becoming celibate? At first, uh, it threw me off because I knew how I lived my life. My biggest reservation was the outside world. I know how people are. They always have something negative to say. So, how did you feel about me sharing that I was celibate with you? Well, at first it threw me for a loop because I don't know why, in the back of my mind, I just knew you were gonna be like me, seeking out partners. Yeah. What were your initial concerns and reservations? My initial concerns were it just felt like you'd be missing out on a big part of life. Yeah. And I had to realize you're not me and you have your own mind. Yeah. Uh, the concerns is I just know how people are by judging. They'll judge you on every little thing. Since becoming celibate, the guys you dated, how have they acted? Um, once it hit social media, I had a few reach out to me, you know, just really inspired by it. However, trying to pursue a future with me, non-existent. Since becoming celibate, I still do date. However, I'm not in a committed relationship. I share on the first date with guys that I am celibate. How is just a in-person conversation. So it's never been through text or through social media. Normally when I share that I am celibate on the first date, guys are floored, they cannot believe it. After revealing that I am celibate, guys do share that they no longer want to pursue anything. When I have shared with my peers my decision on being celibate, a lot of them at first were 
stunned. Um, the pushback is often um, my future relationships. Do you want to get married? Do you want to have kids? Um, how that would impact my dating life. But again, like I share with anyone, I'm just more of a day-to-day -day person. So if it comes, it comes. If it doesn't, I'll still be okay. By being celibate, are you afraid that uh, that to keep guys away from you? Not really. I feel like it really is a superpower. It kind of weeds them out from those that actually see potential versus those that are just looking for a quick hookup. Is it pretty hard to uh, stay celibate during these trying times? In the beginning, it was a bit challenging, but over time and self-discipline, not anymore. Do you feel like you're missing out on anything by being celibate? Not at all. Um, my 20s, I experienced a lot, so no, I feel like I'm right on time, if anything. Okay, I'm glad you passed the 20s there. Thank you. Do you think that you could ever be celibate? No, no, no. Um, I'm in my 50s, uh, started young. I enjoy all my little moments in life. I enjoy the company of a woman too much. Oh. How would you feel if my brother decided to be celibate? Uh, just like you, whatever y'all want, you, your brother, sister, I'm behind you 100%. Uh, like you said, it's a personal thing. Right. Uh, if that's what he wants, I'm behind him. Do you have a date or future plans on uh, breaking your celibacy? Um, when I bring you a son-in-law, hopefully. But other than that, if I don't meet the one, then no. I just plan on carrying this out for a lifetime. You got it. You got it. Thank you. What do you think about my celibacy now? Since you've given me the reasons, I'm, I'm all for it. This is a personal journey, and I'm happy that you're learning to love yourself and getting to know yourself. So I understand now the reason. You set your mind to do something, you follow through. So I'm, I'm happy. I'm glad you're out in the 20s. Yeah. <laughs> you was running a little wild, but uh, I'm so happy you slowed down. So I'm getting ready to go out, hang out with the girls at the local bar, and hopefully I get to meet some fellas. I never feel nervous to tell guys that I'm celibate just because I just rather for them to know ahead of time than later down the line. Being celibate definitely works for me and my lifestyle. Just with me becoming celibate, I think has enhanced my day-to-day -day life. To people that judge my decision on becoming celibate that do not know me in reality, I really feel they need a life check. To say the least, they need a life check because my decisions shouldn't impact your day-to-day -day movement in your life.